Saturday evening, it's a celebration of music, art, and history in Aiken. Opera and Broadway in Banksia being presented at and benefiting the Aiken County Historical Museum. Museum President Jack Jakubik is here to tell us more about the event and what you can enjoy at the museum. Hey, Chris, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Um, before we get to Saturday's event, tell us a little bit about what it's for. The Aiken County Historical Museum, for those who have not been there, what could they expect when they walk through the doors? Well, um, the museum actually celebrated its 50th anniversary in 2020. So it's been around quite a while. It started out in the old jailhouse and then moved to Banksia, which is a winter colony home and one of the only ones that's open to the public. Um, and then for a while shared it with the library. Mm -hmm. It's been a lot of things, but shared it with the library. And when the library moved out, we took over and we have 17,000 square feet of exhibit space in the home in an, its entirety. And it is an amazing setup when you walk in there and check that out. Okay, mm -hmm. I'd have to check that out. So let's it talk is. about this event happening Saturday. It is quite a spectacle here. You have opera and Broadway. Let's let's talk about what we can expect. Well, we're very fortunate to have a wonderful performer coming from New York. Um, one of our board members had a personal connection with her and is helping through New Nation to have her here. And Christina Fontanelli is her name, and she's bringing two performers with her to present Opera and Broadway in Banksia, which is a lovely facility. It has a large um, ballroom or open area. Um, there'll also be hors d'oeuvres and wine. Um, tickets are still available, and there's a great silent auction that will be a part of it. Uh, with great things to bid on. Um, Let's go ahead, and uh, I think we have the information on that. There, there's a screen for it. Uh, so you have that, and again, uh, they will also have uh, hors d'oeuvre starting at uh, 6.30, and the concert will begin at 7 o'clock that evening. Right, okay. uh, nhmfriends.org slash events is where you can get tickets. Uh, Chris, uh, any other events that are coming up at the yes. Museum? Uh, one of the most popular things we do annually is our winter lecture series. And that is starting on February 4th. And for the next six Sundays at 3 o'clock in the afternoon, there'll be lectures on different aspects of this year will be Aiken County, County history. So you'll hear more about the railroad system in Aiken County. Also, uh, when Aiken County was the asparagus capital of the world. I did, uh, I did not uh, know that, and I'm from here. Wow. <laughs> see, the, the things you learn, which is really interesting. How is it when you see people come in, and, you know, they can be from Aiken County, but they learn something that they didn't know about, you know, their, oh, their town? They really like it. And so many people bring uh, friends and family from out of town when, they have, when they're visiting so that they can see what's actually going on. And you just find out, the way it's set up, you just find out so much about what's the history of Aiken County. It's the big white mansion up on the hill. You see the photo right yeah. there. Uh, yeah, let's boys. go ahead and recap the information again for uh, Opera and Broadway in Banksia. Tell us again the dates and the times. It is this Saturday. Uh, I'm blanking on the date. Yes, January 27th, starts at 6 p.m. Tickets are still available on our website, achmfriends.org, or if you Google Friends of the Aiken County Museum, you'll get our website that you can, and it's under events, and you can buy tickets online. All right, VIP tickets also available. Can you purchase them at the door? No. You, you have to get them online. You have to get them ahead of time. Okay, on site. Yeah. Check that out. Chris, thanks so much for joining us and have well, a, thank you for have a great show us. on Saturday. And thank you. We appreciate it.